everyone, Video Game Love here, and I decided I'm going to show you guys my Sega Game Gear collection. NES Attic decided to share his Game Gear collection and some stories he had with it. Awesome video, buddy. So I decided I'm going to make a little response video of my Game Gear collection. So anyways, here is my Sega Game Gear. I got this a year ago. It works pretty good. Um, even though it takes six AA batteries and the capacitors are really bad in this thing, these Game Gears are known to breaking down. I still think this is a good handheld. Um, I kind of wish I picked this up a lot sooner because um, I've seen Game Gears go for like five, ten dollars in thrift stores, and I never picked it up. I don't know what I was thinking. So, anyways, on to the games. This is my first official game, Mad ninety six, and the only reason I bought this was because I, the thrift store had this for like a year. And this was only like two bucks. And for some weird reason, no one would to pick it up. So that's why I got it. It was only two dollars. Here is my first Game Gear game I ever beat in, Sonic Chaos. This is a really good Sonic game, even though it's pretty short and uh, very easy. I still think this is a good game. Uh, Sonic the Hedgehog 1. This is actually a lot different than, than the Genesis version. So I might do a review later on for this version. Because this is actually a lot different than the... Uh, so the Genesis version, and same with this one, Sonic the Hedgehog 2. And believe it or not, I actually think the Master System version came out first, then the Genesis version. So, very interesting fact. This version is really hard, by the way. Um, uh, da -da -da. NBA Jam Tournament Edition. This version is plays very well, but the problem is it there's no save feature, so you have to use passwords. That's dumb. I got that for a dollar, by the way. Same with this game, The Lion King. I got this for a dollar. Uh, pretty okay version. Uh, I guess since we're Disney, here we go. Aladdin on the Game Gear. This is a lot different than the Genesis version, and this game is awesome. This is a really good game on the Game Gear. If you see Aladdin on the Game Gear, pick it up. Aerial Assault. Uh, standard Shmup. It's okay. Really difficult, though, if you die. So I just want to tell you that right now. If you die, you might as well shut the game off. Ren and Stimpy, Quest of the Shaven Yak. Uh, this game is pretty decent. I need to uh, play this game more often, though. Uh, My Morphin Power Rangers the movie. Uh, I need to get the original Power Rangers. Both games kick ass. I'm telling you that right now. This game is a lot of fun. It's like a fighting slash beat em up. It's really good. Plays very well on the Game Gear. Sonic Triple Trouble. Really good Sonic game. And this game is exclusive to the Game Gear. And last but not least, probably my most valuable Game Gear game, Tales of Adventure. I got this game for five bucks um, in Second Charles. This game normally goes for like $30. So I'm very happy. To get this game in the very cheap. So anyway guys. That's uh, my Game Gear collection. It's small but definitely going to grow soon. I'm planning to get more Game Gear games. Alongside with the Game Boy stuff. So anyway guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this collection video. Video Game Lover 15. Signing out. Peace.